Are you aware that you can import a list of properties into PropStream and append our information? Or in other words, get our data? With List Automator's import feature, you can do just that. So if you need property information, mortgage information, or whether to see if a property is on or off market, then we can help you. Or perhaps you have a list of properties that you've had for many, many, many months or years. And maybe you'd like to update it. Well, look no further. I'm going to show you exactly how you can do that. First, make sure you have List Automator and log into PropStream. Once you're logged in, go into My Properties and click on Import Lists. From here, you'll have to follow three steps. Step one, download and use one of the following sample templates, or just click on Download Template. Step two, Enter your existing properties into the template using the example provided. And step three, click the choose file button to upload your save template. Now to save you time, I've already done that for you. So let me just go ahead and choose file and select my file. Now I'll be able to save these addresses to an existing list or create a new one. We'll create a new one. Now I'm gonna go ahead and hit save and PropStream is gonna go to work. At this point, PropStream is gonna take your list of properties and start applying our data to it. So just give it a few moments. Once your import is completed, you'll be able to see the status screen. I'll show you the name, the status, the date in which it was imported, how many addresses were loaded, how many were processed, how many were successfully connected, and how many failed. And if you want to know more information about the ones that failed, go ahead and download the report. This will give your team the ability to do some more research and re-upload those properties. But for now, go ahead and close the status menu and look for your list here on the left-hand side under marketing lists. As you can see, the addresses that you have now uploaded can be selected, allowing you to view the property information of each individual property that was successfully connected. You will also have access to the status bars at the top. So these status boxes will allow you to see how many properties you have in your list, how many are on market, how many have just sold, and 10 additional categories, like which ones are not answering their mail, aka vacant, high equity, low equity, negative equity, bank own, and much, much more. Also, any of these 10 boxes from vacant onward can be customized or refined. So if you're not interested in bank own, feel free to click the edit option and change that box completely. Like maybe you're interested in high equity vacant properties. Once you rename your box, feel free to add a description. Feel free to make this box the default box for all marketing lists going forward. And then finally, apply your filters. So in this scenario, again, I want vacant, and high equity. Finally, I can hit apply and watch PropStream go to work. This is PropStream's List Automator's import feature. I hope that you like what you saw. And if you wanna learn more, make sure to like and follow or click on the help section on the toolbar to learn more.